going to uh, bear shaft tune some 400 spline gold tip hunter arrows for this Dan Toki Whistler. Now, I was holding off on this for a few days because I was waiting for the quiver. Um, I ordered this uh, four arrow Thunderhorn strap on quiver and uh, let me tell you it's super beautiful it really complements this bow see it um, so bows all ready to go like I said 400 spline gold tip hunters uh, we'll glue in the inserts we're gonna start off with full length arrow with 200 grain filled points and then we'll cut back from there and uh, it's a pretty straightforward process, but super important in my opinion. You have straight flying, no feathered arrows out of your bow, at least, at least far back as 15 yards, my opinion, of course. So um, let's get started. Okay, uh, inserts are glued in. And we're going to take three. You only need three arrows to bear shaft tune your bow. Um, three arrows will generally tell you what they're doing, what what's going on. And we're going to screw in 200 grain field points. Okay, uh, no surprise, it's shooting um, knock left. Full length arrow, it's extremely weak. So we're gonna um, start cutting it down, trying to stiffen the arrow up. Okay, so uh, yeah, back here at 20 yards. Um, I've been at it for like a couple hours. To be honest with you, it's been kind of difficult. Um, so I lowered my point weight to 175, and I probably cut, geez, probably another inch and a half off those uh, arrows. Um, I'm still getting a little bit of a knock high. I don't, I don't know if it's just me or. Maybe I'm getting a little frustrated or something, but uh, they're flying okay. I'll take it down here take a look at this last last five that I shot. Um, you know, then again, it, it could be a lot of the target. Um, you know, I'm shooting them into a 3D. So uh, here's, what, here's where we're at right now. Um, so they're, they're pretty much straight on. But it just seems like I'm seeing a little bit of, um, you know, uh, up and down in the air, you know, like, uh, like my knock is too high, but it's not, you know, I've adjusted that, I've tried everything, maybe it's just, maybe I'm just looking at it too close, I don't know, but, um, I think I'm gonna run with this, it looks, it looks pretty decent, I think they're gonna fly right, whatever small imperfections going on, I think, I think my uh, fletching will, uh, you know, will fix that. Guys, that's going to do it for me. Um, of course, the next step is just to fletch these arrows up and just get to practicing. I'll catch you guys on the next one.